you already know if I were cute, just gonna have to take me out. Hello everyone, my name is Sandra and thank you so much for tuning in. All right y'all, so your girl went ahead and bought a mystery box by ColourPop. Why the box isn't branded? I don't know. They have the money to do so, but they sent it in a basic white box. I'm not gonna lie y'all, uh, when I ordered it, I didn't realize it was gonna be all Shadow Palace. When I went to go check my order, I actually read it this time instead of just being like, oh, mystery box, click, click, click. I actually read it and it said five eyeshadow palettes. My plan is to maybe choose one or two that I'm gonna keep for myself and then the others I'm gonna put into a box for a giveaway. I just, I don't need all these eyeshadow palettes. I really don't, especially if they have the same color story as other palettes that I have. I would just be much better off giving those away. Let's go ahead and get into this mystery box. Everything's nice and bubble wrapped. You know, you girl loves some bubble wrap. Keep my king safe. The first one that I'm pulling out, ooh, it has a nice little like individual bubble wrap. I like that. Ooh, this packaging is beautiful. It's called Cashmere Forever. This packaging is absolutely stunning. Look at all that detail. And I mean, the back of it is just as beautiful. That is what I'm talking about. Like, why couldn't they do just like a little detail on the regular like outside box? Like if they're gonna do this, why couldn't they just put something nice on the mailer? I'm just, I'm I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Maybe I'm asking for too much. It has really fun names called Softy, Wanted, Grafting, Madison, and Fifth Avenue. I have no idea what that's referencing. Um, this is gorgeous. This is basic. I was expecting the packaging to have something like this on it. You know what I mean? To keep the aesthetic aesthetic -y. We have a cute little eyeshadow palette. I love these purples. I think that is so pretty. Am I gonna keep this one? Hmm, I'm gonna decide at the end which ones I'm gonna keep, okay? So I'm not gonna swap these. Well, I'm gonna swatch the ones I'm gonna keep. Uh, the ones I'm not gonna keep, I'm not gonna swatch. That is super freaking pretty. You have like a very beautiful purple color story. The next eyeshadow palette, it is called On A Wing. Again, this box is gorgeous. The shadow names are Take Off, Spacey, Flight Thing, Cyrus, and Hope So. Now, I'm wondering if this is gonna also have a purple kind of color story. I'm trying to keep these boxes nice and intact. That way I'm like, I can send you the whole entire thing, you know what I mean? If I'm not gonna keep it. Ooh, okay, so this has more detail on it, but again, it has another purplish kind of color story. I think that is so pretty. And you can see like the little butterflies on the outside. It's a little broken. Because this one is broken, I will keep it. I wouldn't wanna send you guys something that is already broken. You know what I mean? Like if it's broken to me, I'm not gonna send you something else so it can break even further in the UPS. Look at those colors. That is beautiful. Ooh, they're nice and buttery. These shimmers are shimmering. How am I gonna show this to you guys? I put this on the awkward part of my arm. I'm gonna have to do it like this. Can y'all see? Wait, my crusty feet. Can y'all see that? Those went on really nice, very buttery. Purples are extremely difficult to make where it's not gonna be like super patchy. That turned out really nice. All right, let me get you, get your back settled in. I really like that one. That one is really nice. Oh, dirty, dirty fingers, dirty, dirty fingers. I'm gonna go wash my hands really quick and I'll be right back. And I'm back. Reaching into my little mystery, mystery box. And again, another eyeshadow palette. Ooh, this box is nice. And it's called Statement Piece. This one has really pretty names like Diamond Cut, Blair, Love Lock, Hoops, and Chainmail. This is more of a reddish kind of story, like pinky red. That is beautiful. Personally, I don't think it's my favorite. So this is probably gonna go in the giveaway. <laughs> if it's not my favorite, maybe it's your favorite. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna fault y'all for liking things that I don't like. Ooh, okay, so there's two bigger palettes in here. Ooh, wow. Okay, this one is called Roaring Hearts and is a pressed powder palettes. Very pretty. I love that packaging. That is absolutely stunning. And it has names like Fancy That, Lost Gen, Nightlife, Pour Another, Cafe Society, Foxtrot, Phonographed, That Sex, Lindy Hop, and Grand Dame. That is so pretty. This box is just like gorgeous. Hopefully the inside packaging is, is just as beautiful. Ooh. So it does. It does have the same look on the outside. I think that is so pretty, bruh. Get into it. I love that. Those look so nice. And I love how iridescent that eyeshadow palette is. Look at the circles around each hand. And it comes with a mirror. And the mirror has a cute little design on it. I, I might have to keep this one. I'm, I might just have to keep this one. Yeah, I like this. <laughs> Let's do 
some swatches because I'm keeping this. This is the color story on my arm. You know, some shades are showing up better than others. Some are, you know, just okay. I'm keeping her obviously because I swatched her and she's mine. And the final palette that is in here is also a bigger palette and it is so freaking cute. It is called Lemon Cello. It's like embossed and raised. I think that is so beautiful. And it has names like Tuscan Fun, Fly Girl, Easy Peasy, Lemon Squeezy, <laughs> Touring, Amalfi, I think that's what it is, Amalfi, Serenade, Capri, The Grotto, Semi Fredo, Vespa, La Festa. I don't know what some of those words mean, but very, very pretty. This packaging is gorgeous. Be as beautiful as you are on the outside as you are on the in, wait. Be as beautiful on the outside as you are on the, wait, I just said the same thing again. Be as beautiful on the inside as you are on the outside. Okay, that's what I was trying to say. It took me a minute, but I got to it. Ooh, okay, so it is beautiful on the inside too. This is nice and like raised, so you get like a cute little Little texture there and it just it feels really nice bruh I only own one thing from Colourpop other than the, like this mystery box and that was because I got it in a mystery bag and it was like a lip gloss that's the only thing ever I've ever owned from Colourpop so now I'm like color popped out let's look at these colors Ooh, I might have to keep this one too this is beautiful look at that color story I love how you got pops of color but it's also still kind of like neutral and muted you know what I'm saying like you can really make some very stunning looks with this. I think this is so beautiful. Oh my goodness. I'm definitely gonna do some swatches. And the mirror is so pretty. Look at yourself. See yourself. You're doing big things. I love this detail on the side of the mirror. That is beautiful. They have a really nice formula. These feel so buttery and soft and they're going on really well. When you go to put them on your eye for real, for real, it's gonna look a little different because like, you know, usually put a little bit of concealer over your eye so that the colors really pop. Like, you know, color pop. The only thing that I feel a little bit sad about is that I wish this one had more blue in it. They could have swapped out some of these like transition browns for a really nice blue. Come on, come in a little closer. <laughs> Like that one guy. This is the color story on my skin tone. Very, very beautiful. I am in love with that like shimmery green. I actually really like that blue. I don't wear a lot of blues. I will definitely give it a try. I think this is so pretty together. It's mine. <laughs> I, uh... I'm sorry, I'm keeping the two biggest palettes. These are the three that I'm going to keep. And the ones that will be in the giveaway are Sentiment, uh, no, not Sentiment. That does, wait, y'all, why y'all all the way over there? Okay, now you where you're supposed to be. The ones I'm gonna put in a giveaway are Statement Piece and that first one that I saw. I actually really wanted this, but it's okay, it's okay. I won't be greedy. I'm gonna go ahead and put these back in their little boxes, real carefully back into their little boxes. And I'm gonna put those away for a future giveaway. I think my next giveaway will be once I hit 3,000 subscribers. I think that's a good time to do a nice little giveaway of some makeup. Do my own little mystery boxes. <laughs> So these two are going in a giveaway So at some point in time. I think for today, I'm actually gonna try the little palette. I'm gonna go in with this little ibbity thing. I think it'll go better with my beaming blush that I have on right now. Yeah, that blush is just blushing. We're not only gonna try this ColourPop, we're also gonna try this Yves Saint Laurent lipstick, okay? I've been so excited to try this. I have not tried it on my lips yet. I did a little swatch on my back of my hand. I'm very excited to try this out. All right, y'all, so I'm gonna go ahead and get into this palette. It is so freaking cute. I'm gonna clean off my brush really quick. I don't want to put nothing old into the new. The only shade that you can really use as a transition is this one right here. So I'm going to go ahead and get into that. It doesn't have a lot of kickback, at least not this pan. You already know if I look cute, just going to have to take me out. My transition is down. I'm gonna go ahead and deepen it up with this dark berry shade right here. And I'm just gonna like tap that on first. And then I'm actually gonna clean my brush and then blend it out. That way it's not too much. This will go left real fast. I want to get to the point where I can do like cut creases and stuff. Yeah, girl, not there yet. <laughs> that is a bit above my pay grade. So I'm gonna clean my brush off and I'm actually gonna go back into my transition and just kind of blend that out just a little bit more. 
All right, now I'm actually gonna go in with my wicked finger. Okay, I'm gonna do the deeper shade on my lid and the lighter shade on my inner corner highlights. I think that looks so pretty, bruh. Get into it. I don't know why when I'm doing stuff to my like face, I'm putting like makeup on or if I'm washing my face, I do like this. Like, what is that? <laughs> why do I automatically do? Like, I don't get it. <laughs> I'm gonna actually go in with this color right here and I'm going to smoke out my bottom right now. See, I'm doing it again. Pretty. Now, I'm gonna go in for my inner corner highlights. Okay, the inner corner gotta get hoi hoity. Oh yeah, that is beautiful. Bruh. Okay, Justin's taking me out. As long as I don't mess it up, uh, Justin is taking me out today because I look too good. I look too good to keep in the house. Next, I'm going to go in with my Stila. I'm gonna line these eyes, okay? Put the eyes in line. Get the eyes in line. I need more lights. I can't see. All right, that's as good as it's gonna get. I'm just, I'm done. I'm over it. <laughs> okay, I am over it. Next, I'm gonna go in with my KVD. Wait, before I do that, I'm gonna spray myself down a little bit. Just a little spray spray. This time, I'm using the NYX Matte Finish Finny Matte. Okay, love this stuff. It is affordable and nice. Okay, we like affordable and we like nice. Next, I'm gonna go in with my KVD tubing mascara. This time, I'm gonna try not to mess up my look. I'm gonna just kind of like keep my eyes real demure-like and not blink for the next three minutes. Oh, it makes me wanna blink. Uh. We can do this, we can do this. Can we go in for another round? I think that's good, I think that's good. Let's not chance it. Next, I'm gonna go in with my ZC so I can get that lower lash line, okay? The lower lashes. Y'all can't see, but I am doing the mouth thing again. The last, but definitely not least, okay? Definitely not, not, not the least, not least at all, is my Yves Saint Laurent lipstick. So pretty, y'all, that is gorgeous. We're gonna try this on for the first time, my fancy rich bit lipstick. Let's see how this goes on. It smells amazing. Bruh, it smells like candy. I'm not even joking. It smells like a Jolly Rancher. This is a look. I like this. I think I look actually really nice. Where we going? Okay, where we going? Y'all, I was a little bit upset when I found out it was gonna be a bunch of eyeshadow palettes, but now I ain't mad at it, okay? I actually am very happy with this mystery box. That is everything that I had in my mystery Ipsy. Not Ipsy. I do so many Ipsies that every time I say mystery, I instantly think Ipsy. No, this is mystery color pop. Mystery pop, 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 color pop. I actually really liked all of the different things that I got. I got a few items for the giveaway. I got a few items for a moi. And I got a nice little makeup look that just ain't gonna take me out in. If you like this content, you already know what to do. Like, share, comment, and definitely subscribe so that you can become a Fey Bay. And I will see y'all with the next one. Deuces.